now. It's time for Cartoonerific News. Hi, cartoon fans, and welcome to Cartoonerific News. I'm Marjorie, and we've got some news for today, Tuesday, August 6th, so let's get right to it. Inside Out 2 is now the highest grossing animated film of all time, the 10th highest grossing movie in history, and is now roughly $270 million over the 2015 original film's highest domestic gross. After staff cuts of around 14% earlier this year to ensure Pixar's survival, this success takes the animation giant well above and beyond stasis. Coming up, in summer 2025, Salvation Poem Project's beautifully hand-drawn animated film, Light of the World, will be released into theaters. With the animation by Irish-based 2D outfit Lighthouse Studios, Light of the World follows the journey of Jesus as told through his faithful young apostle John. Directed by John Schaefer and co-directed by Tom Bancroft, Light of the World tells the story of the man from Nazareth, from his humble ministry, through his crucifixion, to his ultimate resurrection, and powerfully illustrates how his brief existence changed the world forever, and still changes lives today. Samples of the production art are available to view now on SalvationPoem.com, and the film hits theaters in the summer of 2025. Warner Brothers Discovery has announced it will shut down its cartoon streaming service Boomerang next month, as the entire service's catalog of shows will be merged onto Max. The Boomerang app and website will terminate at sundown on September 30th, 2024. Starting September 30th, you can watch fan-favorite Boomerang shows alongside Max's full catalog of iconic series, hit movies, fresh originals, breaking news, and family favorites, including The Amazing World of Gumball, Teen Titans Go!, Lego Batman, and more. In other Warner Brothers news, from Warner's Archives collection comes the long-awaited, fully restored Looney Tunes Collector's Choice Volume 4. This will be out just in time for the holidays on Blu-ray on November 26th and is available for pre-order now on Amazon. Our very own Cartoonerific podcast host, Brian Mitchell, will be back again at the end of this week for part two of his interview with director Barry Caldwell. Caldwell has worked on many TV shows, including Animaniacs, as a storyboard artist and director, and continues to discuss his career with Brian in the next Cartoonerific podcast episode. It will be uploaded this Friday, August 9th at 10 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, 7 p.m. Pacific, and is available pretty much anywhere you get your podcast, friends. And that's about it. Thank you for checking back with us at Cartoonerific News, and we'll be back next Tuesday, August 13th, with more. Until then, take care. This has been a Cartoonerific Studios presentation. The Cartoonerific Podcast is copyright 2024 by Cartoonerific Studios Incorporated. All rights reserved.